Oh, I think we're on. I missed your cue. You know why? <laughs> I was Be, you know, no, and, and let's keep it going because what happens is that I decided to turn all the lights off today to make it moody for you guys, apparently, and uh, and that means that I can't see Gabby's hand. <laughs> Can it be on time next time? Yeah, no, it's all good, but we're rolling, right? Mm-hmm. So we're in the new studio with Mr. Christian Bobby, who's a who's a who's an alum of the show. Yes, sir. So thanks for coming back. No problem. And he brought Manny Morales, it's which I've been wanting to get you on the show. Actually, you called him out to be on the show. Yeah. A while back. I did, on the show. Yeah. And I think you on cursed on, to camera and everything. And you said, get your fucking <laughs> said, ass in here. Nah, that was yeah, you did. That was John. Oh, yeah. that was No, John. it was I him. Said, oh, man, I called. I you said a lot of, yeah, you said a lot of. A lot of you called, man. This is going to be the PG version of, yeah. of last time's Try episode. Anyway. That's all right. You can, you can get loose. You, you're not even drinking, but you can get loose today. So what, what is, uh, well, first of all, welcome. You know, thanks for, for joining us on the, on the new digs. What do you think? Better? Worse? Are we moving on up? Definitely. You dig it? Spacious. You know, yeah. it's looking good. Thanks, You're brother. doing well. Thanks, we're trying. <laughs> You're doing well. <laughs> <laughs> Am I, though? Uh, what's going on, guys? What's what's going on with fights? So, you have a fight that you're trying to get. Yeah, we'll see what happens. We're, we're, we'll we're trying to line something up. Yes, sir. And then so, you had a fight. My kids actually pulled out. So, hopefully the 30th. 30th of um, October? October. October. Oh, Halloween. So, fight. we'll see about that. Uh, maybe making my pro debut. Hey. For that one? Yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. So it's up to my coaches, you know what I mean? Everything goes off of them, but... So, so that's actually... That's always something I wonder as far as when you make that decision. Because you haven't turned pro either. No. Um, so this fight you were about to have wasn't going to be pro? So it was going to be... It's an advanced enemy. So it's like okay. ocean guards, um, ground and pound. Stuff so it's like basically that. a pro so fight, it's kind of, it's pro rules. It's getting you ready for pro rules, yeah. Okay. Which I love the CFFC for doing that because not other, yeah. well, not many uh, other they people. They do. Um, other CFFC people do? just labels it next gen, but but they, it's just advanced enemy. Like there's an amateur, which is like, I think you have to have three wins and then you can go advanced amateur. Which okay. I think you gotta it may be three fights or three wins. Just but, to kind so of prove that you're ready. First, to do that. I think it, it depends first, what state. Too. Yeah, yeah. But then yeah. first, like one or two fights, it's a regular amateur. Then you, I think you, I think it's three wins. You get three wins or maybe three fights. And then you, then it's advanced amateur, which has they have ground and bound, take off the shin pads. Some states you can head kick, some states you can't. Yeah, that's why people go south, right? Mm -hmm. to yeah, and north, you know, okay, like just York, not here. Head kick, yeah, okay. just like Jersey and PA just has like the strictest like amateur rules. For, okay, it's kind of sucks, but you know, kind of do? they do the same thing with a lot of other things. Yeah, very yeah, strict. What do? So what makes what what goes through your head when you want to switch from amateur to pro like is there were you ready for that anyway or um, what happened there yeah. honestly i feel like a lot of us are ready yeah i think it's just yeah the main thing is just put in what you do in the practice room out there yeah okay. that's why the amy fights like you know what i mean i can yeah. be a savage in the room but translating fight, it yeah so okay. it takes a little bit to translate and that's my problem yeah, like I got trained with some of the best in the world. You Actually, know? John Same called you out on that too yeah. when he was on the show. I yeah. think he was saying, I think yeah. he was saying that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They yeah. kind of went hard on you a little. Same bit. thing with this guy. This guy trains with some of the best too. It's about putting. Yeah, we're both more studs, fights. You know, yeah. we're both we're both pro high yeah. pro level fighters. It's just about train, like he said, translating it into cage. And I think that just comes with experience. That's I was going to say that's that's an experience thing. Fight amateur. Yeah. Man, that's why you want to fight amateur because you're going. It's a fight at the end of the day. You know, it's especially CFFC. It's you feel like damn near the UFC. It's it's close, yeah. you know, the promote like everything about it. Everybody Especially is. at parks, like well you're supposed, uh, he was supposed to fight this weekend. He I didn't know. say that. It was this weekend. But anyway, yeah. like the production you feel like you're you're you feel like you, you know, what you're aspiring to be. There's no difference. Like, and if you're nah, there as an audience yeah. like member, exactly. you don't see any yeah. difference yeah. between so that feeling everything's you want to get used same. to that feeling and just being yeah. out there. Yeah. You want to get used to that. Which you can't if you turn pro, you like you have one pro career at and that's it, you know. Can you imagine what it would be like for you guys, like you know, basketball players, how they used to go from like high school straight yeah, into the NBA? Straight, yeah. Can you imagine if you went from like? Well, yeah. There's some yeah. guys that do it that don't take any NBA fights, go straight yeah. pro. But how, that's how does that go for them? It depends on the guys. Yeah, so the it's guy, like some guys are like stud division yeah, yeah. wrestlers, like two-time NCAA champs, and then they'll they'll just turn right, pro. Right, 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 right. That makes sense. Like Henry Cejudo, for example, he was an Olympic champ, and yeah. then he just turned right to pro for his MMA. Right, but if you're an Olympic athlete you're used to that stress yeah. level yeah. you're you know you're competing at the highest level, level and in front of a huge audience yeah, exactly. so like yeah. i'm sure i'm sure you're ready so so then is there a comfort in being an amateur because you feel like you're still sharpening the tools and there's not the risk versus reward is i mean in a competitive way you always want to win you know what i mean like yeah. it's gonna it's gonna stick with you like if you were a pro but you do see it as more i feel like as a practice like it's not so much stress i feel like 
but it's more like, all right, I know what I'm here for. I'm going to let a little more loose yeah. out this fight. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Focus on some. Maybe I won't be as scared to, like, maybe I'm working on striking this fight. You know what right. I mean? Now, I'm projecting here because obviously I haven't been in that case ever. But I f- don't fucking laugh at me. <laughs> you didn't know about my past? I'm, no, no. I'm training. You know, we're getting there. <laughs> I feel like I can beat Morel. Who, 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 let's I, talk. Them kicks were lethal. They were, I was feeling them on the. Plane. If a bug can scare Borel in an octagon, I feel like my kicks oh could do some damage. God. Just I saying. I totally forgot about that. Dude, he that held was, the cage and everything. That, that was, was funny. you know he's not allowed on the show now. No, 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 he's gonna come, but we're gonna make him stay in the dark. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's not coming. He'll be the background. He'll be the background. No, but what I what I was trying to project was, um, I feel like you are comfortable in your in your, you know, in your gym, for lack of a better word. Um, and you have all these tools that you're ready to use, but then the, when the moment comes, does it just fucking fly by so quick that you almost feel afterwards like fuck? Well, I, I wanted it to do this yeah. and it just didn't come out. One hundred percent, right? One hundred percent. That's gotta be frustrating. And that as well. also comes with it only being three minute rounds. You feel like that's you're cool. so rushed that like that's why I feel like I'm more meant for pro. Mm-hmm. Five rounds, five minute rounds. I feel like I can move around. Same. I get See started stuff. later in the fight too. Yeah. I get started like it takes a little bit to, yeah. to yeah. get going, you know. Which is kind of equivalent to like boxers who like feel way more comfortable boxing without headgear, without all yeah. this bullshit. Well, and that then sucks. that's just a different that's, a whole, that's just that's a whole different. <laughs> that's just a whole different ball game. The you're like get this stuff. thing all. But that's what I'm saying. But like yeah. in their opinion, it's like I would much rather be fighting loose and comfortable without all this bullshit. Yeah. But because yeah. it's amateur, obviously they have to. Was yeah. that a bad comparison? Bad comparison. But maybe they don't well, want to wear like, tank tops, bro. It was such a bad like your slide. Yeah, no, yeah. you can bust my balls. But <laughs> but they don't like tank tops, bro. The tank tops yeah. don't uh don't let you move around loosely. But yeah, but MMA is different though, because you got it's like just a comp- it's a different sport kind of it is. for us. Like yeah. for our amateur, not now because advanced amateur is a little different. But like elbows, knees, you know, head kicks, ground and bound. Compared to boxing, you're you're still boxing. You know, amateur to pro, you're. St- you're just boxing, you know. Yeah. yeah. M- MMA, there's it, a lot of a lot of things get added when you turn pro. I. But would, it's definitely for the better, you know. Like mm-hmm. I think it makes it way better. Like throwing throwing head kicks, you can't do that in amateur. It's like in the gym, we're throwing head kicks. Yeah. I was gonna say so too. So are you more upset about the limitations you have on yourself, or is it beneficial because you know you also don't have to worry about that asset from that other fighter? I don't even think about that honestly. I just. Work with me here, bro. I just go out there and fight. Yeah, when it's time you know? to go, it's time to go. But you don't ever think like I can't throw that one thing that I'm not yeah. allowed to well, throw. You're just aware of it, you know. You you like. Is it easy? When when you have a fight remember? coming, you know not to throw. Like, yeah. Maybe you're, you're like, okay, I'll only throw body kicks. I won't, you know, ground and pound to the head if you can't. So you're training for, it, but it's just yeah, it's just different. It's I feel like different. I would forget and just start fucking doing the it's wrong high, thing it's immediately. It's sure. And you I get disqualified. In a fight one time. And you get disqualified. Well, it was touch to right, right to the yeah. Uh, it might have been to the chin. It depends. We'll, you we'll get say the chest. It was bad. We'll see. But they give you a little leeway just in case you. Probably the first time it's like a warning. Unless you knock the guy out, you might get yeah. you might get DQ'd. Yeah. Well, were you telling me that almost kicked somebody a yeah. soccer kick? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That was bad. That it was, was like a soccer kick. Badass. Badass. Yeah, because it was literally in the just crowd. Like, yeah, but it hit him like right yeah. here. So I think. Yeah. But the way you said it was funny. It was like everybody was cheering because he was winning and then he did that. Or it was yeah. like, no. I think everybody, I thought it was on TV. I just said the same thing. It looked like a bad kick. Like it cracked him right in the head. But Now that we're speaking about this shit, what do you think about the whole uh, uh, Jan versus uh, uh, Aljo? I mean, and the, and the, the whole situation with them and think- the illegal... Knee to the head, all that bullshit. I think he's taking advantage of it. I mean, it's a good thing, right? You want to get people to hate you. It made me yeah, not like he's him. He's definitely making yeah. it work, but I mean, it was a bad knee. You can't you can't say that it wasn't a bad knee. The knee rocked him, but I would say he was maybe he was definitely acting it out a bit. I mean, yeah. He, what are you gonna do though? What bothered me is that he took the, the belt. belt. Yeah. yeah, and then he was running with it and stuff, and he was partying with it that night. Well, I, yeah, I, I, I fought his brother, so I followed his brother on Instagram. Oh, you fought his brother? I saw him. That night, I see like he's recording. I don't. He's like recording Al Jermaine coming in like celebrating. I think it was I, just, I thought fans. it was a little weird. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. It was but super weird. Respect to them. I respect him. I respect his brother. I like. Well, yeah. I don't. Know. I liked him a lot more. I I I was more of a fan before he took the belt. Same. Then Same. after he took the belt, and because yeah. now he's he it's almost gotten silly like with his being defensive about it. Well, and then he pulled out just recently, and then he, he's pulled he, out twice, I think. Right? Yeah, but the same day he, he pulled out, and then he. 
And then he uh, yeah. like was like, okay, I'm not gonna pull out. And then he pulled out again. Yeah. And he was in the corner with like, Rob. Warming like, him up. Yeah. And right, 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 right. Yeah, so it was yeah he was in the embedded and shit. And then yeah. all of a sudden he's yeah. like, no, I'm out because my neck is not, it's not right yet. Yeah. yeah. But then again, I saw something that he wasn't supposed to originally fight until December, and and the UFC was like pushing it for October, but he initially didn't want to do that. But I don't know shit. There's honestly. two perspectives though. The, the um, Anthony Smith against John Jones. You realize what difference he would have in life if he would have taken the belt when he got yep. illegally kneed as well? Yeah. To the face? That's true. That's character. Made me like him a lot more. Yeah. And I was already a fan, but it was like this fucking guy. Like, yeah. he's there to grind and do it the right way. He's not yeah, there to yeah. get a freebie. And as then, a competitor, you don't want to win that one. No. no. Not at all. No. So I think, I think, I think I'll just maybe, maybe lost some fans. Oh, I'm, he 100%. He, just he, he lost respect. He definitely lost right? a lot of respect from a lot of people. So San Hagen is supposed to fight Peter Jan now. Yep. Yeah. Which I think is great a fight. great fight. Oh, yeah. um, and then, I mean, Al Jermaine makes a perfect point. If San Hagen beats him, then it's a rematch. Yeah. And he last time went out by choke, right? Yeah, he submitted him. Mm-hmm. So, but I don't think it made it look again. easy, too. I don't think that happens uh, again. That's what I'm saying. San Hagen's, he's a real deal. Dude, I'm the way fan. he fucking knocked up for, uh, Edgar. Yeah, that was, that was just mean. Circled him into it. Beautiful, man. That's exactly what I said when it happened. Yeah. I'm just joking. I, 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 I did not, you know, th- think it through that much. I just said, "Holy shit, he stiffened up." Uh, so what? So you guys are tra- you guys train together often? Probably. So what's the What's the relationship here? What's What's yeah, the friendship? Yeah. yeah, we're we're teammates, boys. Yeah, it's yeah. My dog. yeah, we yeah. train probably say every day together. Yeah. How long have you guys known each other? Uh, probably like four years now. Yeah, we came onto the team same exact same time. exact time. Like yeah, which was cool. Funny yeah. story. We uh, rolled together, right? I think the first yeah. What, tore his, hurt my knee? Tore, <laughs> tore his yeah. knee. First the first day. The first day you guys coming yeah. to first the first day I remember that yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Did he hurt it because you did something to him? Or yeah. Just... yeah, he did like this stupid ass <laughs> trick. I was bad as hell. Yeah. But, but I like Manny now. Yeah. So. How long did it take now. after you healed? I think right. I mean, I liked him initially. But I'd say, I don't know. I wasn't really mad. You know, <laughs> shit happens in the gym, but. It was unfortunate. It was definitely unfortunate. Does that? I feel like that would happen a lot with like new guys. Do you guys worry about new guys hurting you because they don't know how to? Yeah, you. You kind of know off the bat. Yeah, you kind of don't go with yeah. people that are new right away, especially if you have a fight coming up. Like if someone new. You don't want to get hurt. It depends if they're like if we know that they're a good fighter, like we know who they are, then that's completely different. But if it's just some random guy on the street that wants to come in and be a fighter, I don't think any of us are gonna no. practice with them right away. Until, yeah, like, just kind of feel it out a yeah. little bit. Yeah. How often do new people just randomly show up? I feel like now, well, now, like, man, now the, more, the right? The gym's growing so oh, wow. much, yeah. But uh, but you still, I mean, you're we're nice to the guys, but sparring stuff, we're never gonna spar with the new people right away. But yeah, like the people, the gym, the gym's grown so much. Like, so you told me. Uh, so for those of you who don't know, who can't see how good of a shape I'm getting in, um, <laughs> <laughs> I wore a hoodie today. Um, we did a private. Yep. On what Wednesday? Yep. Um, you know. You, you want to rate me? Rate? <laughs> rate this guy? I'll give him like a like a six. A six? Okay, seven. it's not bad. It's not it was, bad. You were punching hard as hell, I'm not going to lie. I wasn't expecting you to have that much power. Mm-hmm. You know, The technique definitely needs some work, but... It does. It doesn't help, yeah. that, he, it, it doesn't help that he did a private with Andre, too. Now we got to get you sparring. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't help that he did hit pads with Andre. Now man. we got to get you Is that sparring. a bad thing? I didn't know that. <laughs> have you... Nah, he... He's good at pads. No, and you can be honest. <laughs> Andre. Yeah. So, so tell me about Andre. He's, he's and his he's and his striking. He's, he's, awesome. he's great. But his pads are terrible. Yeah. <laughs> you know, there's yeah, pads. I wouldn't. He'd be like uh, one two. Yeah. Uh, one two. If you want, <laughs> we, <laughs> we did a lot of one two threes. Yeah. A lot of one two yeah. threes. He's it's, a man. I love Andre. Yeah. But once we got to four, I would forget what to do, or he would forget what to do. Yeah. So it was pretty funny when yeah. we did pads, but it was great. It was, um. It was good. So you were telling me, anyway, the reason I asked you that was because I was trying to ask you. Um, so you said that you guys spar at 11. Is that every single day? No, that's Wednesday and Saturday. Saturday is at 10. Yeah. So how heavy do you guys go in sparring? Because well, <laughs> I see some videos and <laughs> I see you guys going. Well, you have to. That's the yeah. fight simulation. You know, that's the closest that you're going to get to being in the cage fighting. So, so there's like 50 wet. of you, though, at yeah, the same that, time. Yeah. Wednesdays are supposed to be our hard days, big gloves. Um but I think both days kind of turn pretty well. <laughs> yeah. It's just... Well, the Saturdays, it's small gloves, so yeah. yeah. Okay. Do you start light and then slowly get heavier as people land? Probably. In yeah. a competitive way? Whoever sets the pace, yeah. we'll, we'll, you'll know off the yeah. first punch. Okay. Yeah, that's a yeah. good way to put it. And then how... So then, 
I'm exaggerating when I say 50, but there's a fuckload of you in one area oh, well, at the same time. Probably are you guys yeah, exchanging 50, partners at yeah. some point? Well, it depends. Yeah. Certain guys will stay with, like, Sean will stay with his set of group because, I mean, he's Sean, but, like, <laughs> like we'll switch. We'll just, yeah, every round we get a new guy. Okay. Yeah. Um, who do you guys like? Do you guys spar together? Or do you guys? Nah, we're, we're I mean, totally sometimes different. we'll, like, t- like What do you mean, hell no? Why not? We're he's, way huge. Too he's huge. He's huge. Plus, many. He, he's got like heavy. He, I wouldn't spar with him. <laughs> I wouldn't spar with him. I don't want to. So it's you know what makes me laugh too in those pictures is always somebody some and maybe you give me a real reason but to me it's hilarious to see everybody going at it and there's always one guy sitting. Oh yeah, because yeah. it's because yeah. it's, it's he can't find a dancing partner. It depends. There are different reasons. Sometimes maybe you got hurt the round before. Yeah, yeah there's, it's an odd numbers. person. Oh okay. Yeah. Yeah, it just does. Depends. It just makes me laugh. I feel like that would be me. <laughs> They'd be like, I don't want yeah, to. I don't want to get in there. Yeah. No, no, you guys go. No, it's all good. Um, <laughs> did you guys see the fights last weekend? You told me you fell I asleep. fell asleep, but I saw. Well, I only fell asleep for the Nick Diaz fight, which was unfortunate. That's the only one I wanted to see. But and you didn't watch it afterwards. You didn't find it. Nah, I mean I didn't watch. Gabby it. has all the illegal streams if you ever need. <laughs> see, <laughs> she's got the hook. It might come for you. Yeah. Yeah. Come for you now. Yeah. Uh, she's Gabby at Hotmail, and I'm just. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, did you see him? Yeah. Yeah, they were good. Um, give me, give me some breakdowns. What did you think? I think Diaz should definitely hang him up. It's a little, it you think a little, so? I think it was a little. Sad. I thought he was scrapping though. I didn't. See, I didn't see it, but I heard that it, like he was putting up a good fight. His, I, I his really kick, his kick in the it. beginning was yeah. fabulous. I didn't want to see him fight in the first. It week. took it four like, seconds to spin, like to get to the to turn around. Yeah, yeah. yeah he looked old. For sure. He took he a lot old. of damage as it is. It's like you don't want to see that guy. Yeah. Get punched. In I thought his striking looked decent. It didn't look bad, but it's he was he was accurate. Yeah. They were just soft. They, like yeah. I, I wasn't seeing any damage really. He just didn't look into it. Oh, Robbie, Robbie Lawler is a savage too. Exactly. I think somebody said that um, he should fight Cowboy. It kind of makes sense. Who? Nick uh, Diaz. Diaz. Yeah. If he comes. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad idea. I can see that happening. I'm rocking with Three Cowboy. Rounds. I'm rocking with Cowboy too, but I can see that being like a fun fight. Yeah. Because Cowboy's not going to get hurt or knocked out yeah, like he has been. Could be. Exactly. I think Cowboy probably knocks him out, but he might. I don't think Diaz gets knocked out, but. I don't think those guys get knocked they out. Don't get knocked Maybe out. not. Maybe no. not. Who was to stand out that night? Like, what was your favorite fight? Jeff Chenko. I'd say well, I saw that fight. Like, she's that a fucking beast. She impressed. I love. She's probably my favorite player, honestly. Dude, oh, she's so good. Murphy didn't do one thing. It's like, oh Murphy. No. Oh my god. It's like, what do you just? Yeah, but why the, the fuck do you decision. get? But why do you? She I just. Don't know. I feel like she just wanted to say or like just say I survived or like you know what I mean. Fuck you all that tell, though. You could tell off the bat that's what she wanted. And it's like she wasn't a real. Champion. I think DC called it like called it out he was like are you telling her that in the corner because her goal here was to survive the fight I think or because she was, was trying to win yeah because if she was trying to win you're not telling them the right they're telling her the right I didn't thing hear what they were saying. it's it's it wasn't it was not a good look that's another one where you lose kind of like respect in my opinion yeah it's like i mean i didn't and she talked a lot going up yeah she did act like she was hot shit but i mean you kind of got to in that situation she probably got paid decent you know oh yeah yeah, yeah, this is her biggest payday. Yeah, but she's sure. never gonna but get back there. But in that division, again. though, it's like who's gonna who's messing with Valentina? You know, no one. No. She's like what? Uh, what's her face? Was like four in the world? Lauren, whatever, Murphy. Murphy. Yeah. yeah she's yeah. like four in the world. You know who's right? The that's number four. Who's three, two, Andrade and one. Andrade is the only person. Not touch her. Right. That's what I'm saying. The, I'm saying the, the levels in that close. division. Yeah. Well, Andrade got fucked up by Valentina. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, Valentina was saying she has like 28 years in martial arts. Like, that's older than how how old these people in the division are. Yeah, that's a good point. You know, that's what she was saying. She said it in the interview. But And their whole family is like... Yeah, sad. That's what they've been doing yeah. their whole yeah. life. I, yeah. I feel like I always talk about her sister, but I feel bad for her sister. Yeah, You're like, you know what I mean? Like, your sister. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> like well, we're All talking right. about fighting, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I like your sister. I'm a fan. She's terrible compared to her older she's, sister. She's cute. Ah, she's see, we get to the bottom of it. Yeah. No, it's a, it's, a, it's a very cute family, but still, <laughs> I'm just saying. I just feel bad because it's like this, you know, you'll never be as good as your sister and you keep on losing. And I don't know, did she lose her last fight? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, Honestly, that's a good question. <laughs> She's kind of, Valentina's the only one that's in the spotlight. Yeah. So. It sucks having a family like that. Yeah. Like, Valentina talks fucking Spanish. He talks she Russian. Everything. She talks she just added she's, she's charismatic. Thai. She said she's learning Thai. She's learning Thai. She does a fucking yeah, flamenco she spoke dance. Thai at the at the fights yeah. in the interview. She's all awesome. crazy. She's a badass. She's a martial artist. So how did you I already know your backstory. How did you get started in this whole So I was a crazy kid, man. I was always fighting on the streets and I just I don't know, I always loved it. I always loved the rush of it. You were a crazy kid? Yeah. <laughs> You look pretty calm though. Is he not calm? Wild, man. Yeah. Are you putting on a facade right now? 
Yeah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> um, I don't know. I was a I was a wild kid. I just loved to fight. I just I grew up watching UFC, Chuck Liddell, all these guys. Yeah. And I remember playing the games. I was sparring my brother. Get beat up by him. He was a lot older than me. Where'd you grow up? What area? Camden. Oh, you were. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. So that's actually where I had my first fight. I think I was like six years old, right in the parking lot. Um, were uh, what's your nationality background? Italian, Puerto Rican, Nicaraguan. And what? Nicaraguan. I Nicaraguan. You're a fucking mix. Yeah. If well, Morales is the Puerto Rican side. Yeah. Oh, I see. Right. I, I want to get the Rican. DNA test, man. Like the I'm sure I got some crazy <laughs> stuff. I just want to see. Yeah. I, mean, I want to see. I'm curious. I think it would be cool. A couple guys that I know have been talking about it. So. Wait, for you yourself? <laughs> what do you mean? For You want to see his? You no, wanna no, see no, I want to see mine. I, I thought you wanted to see his. I don't care about his. I'm like, is he calling him a mutt? Yeah, yeah, it's cool to see. It's cool to see. You should get it done, too. But you're, aren't you Puerto Rican, too? Yeah, we're the same. I mean, I'm Puerto Rican and Italian. That I know of, you know. I might have some Nicaraguan in there too. <laughs> By the way, you guys are brothers. Yeah, right. <laughs> you find out later. Uh, so what's the mom? What's the dad? What's the what's the breakup here as far as nationalities? How so my mom's Italian, hundred percent. Okay. Uh, my dad's Nicaraguan, Puerto Rican. Okay. Yeah. Did they meet in Camden? Yeah. So yeah. They both grew up together. Yeah. Are you still out of Camden? No, right now I'm in um, AC actually, so like Galloway area. Okay. So it's like an hour from here. And you drive every day to train. Every day. What made you move over there? So, at senior year, my dad moved over there and I moved home. Uh, yeah. Was he work over there in that area? Like, did he move for work? So, it was like he met someone else relationship type wise. Um, and then we just all moved together. Do you like it over there? Oh, <laughs> it's like, like woodsy. It. I like it, man. It's like deers out there. I like and... fishing, though, because it's right down the street. Right you and Pat, street. man. Yeah, I, just, I tried it with him one time. I'm this like, guy Pat has walked it? in with the fishing rod. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? Did no, he didn't. But oh, he, okay. but he had him in the back of his car. I have mine in my car too. You gotta keep them ready. Only thing I was. But the one day rocks. we fished with him, man, he cast it like we were fishing this way. It went back. It literally. <laughs> he went like, and it went. Choo. I was like, I put it down. I was like, All right, I'm done for the day. Yeah. That I. It takes I, too much patience. I try to take my kids fishing, and I told Pat this. Like, I know nothing about fishing. I think yeah, I, I maybe was taken like two or three times growing up. Yeah. I don't fucking remember. I remember the little weights. We used to go to Kmart to buy shit, and like, I just, I don't know. It's, yeah, it's not, I, I think you need to know what you're doing. Or if you to like, enjoy. I mean, it's something that you gotta just, yeah, enjoy doing. Do you catch and eat shit or no? All the time. That's the best part. Yeah? I, I yeah, I like fish and salt water the best because you, I mean, you, I don't, I'm not eating stuff from around I was gonna here, say, it, so nah. we talked about that in that episode too yeah. because I was saying that around here, if you look at that chart they give you, like, you can't eat anything. No, nah, I wouldn't touch like, anything. 90% will kill you. Here. Yeah. But the salt water, I, I mean, anything I catch. That's the goal, to go out there and catch a keeper. Do you do it from the shore, from a boat, from a dock? Yeah, mostly from the shore. I don't have a boat. But okay. Uh, the couple times, I, got, I mean, obviously, I'd rather fish on a boat that you're catching. Like, your chances go up significantly. What beach around here is good to fish? They, they say Jersey Shore. Like, it's just all of Jersey Shore is, like, some of the best fishing in the country. But, I mean, I've been liking AC lately. I, I have, a, like, a love-hate relationship with AC. Because, like, sometimes it sucks, sometimes it's good. Um, but there's a lot of spots. Corson's Inlet, which is in like Ocean City. Um, Bragantine is good. You don't have to throw anything back when you fish from the shore. You do. It's, it's so yeah, it's size. It, it, and, it's and, like and a foot. Seasons or something? and stuff. Too. It's just all. It's different. Like flounder is different than striper, which is different. I'm taking anything I get. The show. Oh, oh, my oh my lord, God. he's real. <laughs> Dude, we've been just fucking grinding, coming up with things. We're talking about fishing right now. <laughs> I love fishing. This guy's the worst. <laughs> fishing's the best. No, so I'm asking you because my kids want to s- squeeze in one more fish trip. Oh. Can I do it still? Is it still, it's not too late? To fish like around here? Yeah, and well, and would you recommend just going to the beach? Yeah, I'm going We've this never weekend. Going I'm going Saturday. You want? You should come. After sparring, I'm going to go down and fish. You got to spar too, though. That'll be a good time. You should come. I have no worries about any of it. <laughs> I have no fear in any of this. I'm going to get my ass whooped, but I have no fear. Yeah, you should but come. Sean, he said he wants some... Some rounds. Did you hear? No, I'm good. Get in there, bro. Yeah, you want to come squeeze in? What are you doing? I'll scoot over, bro. Oh, First of all, I haven't had anything to drink, assuming that we're going to have a whiskey now. Yeah. Fun, bro. <laughs> I like your gritty shirt. be tight on this drum. Yeah, we are. It's all right. You guys squeeze on in. Get comfy. You guys know each other? Scoot over a little. never seen these kids before in my life. No? Yeah, all right. They're fighters. Too. Like you. Yeah. You're a fighter, too? This guy's the... All the glasses oh, are freshly right clean. The By the way, I got you a Blattens. You, I don't know if you had the Dalmore before. No, I've never, I've never seen. Try this that. One. Try that. Give me a little, give me a little sip too, if you don't mind. 
the Japanese whiskey. That oh, I drank that before. What is this? Me and Isa. It was a long day. It was you know actually what, you a long what Isa day. gave me? It has nothing to do you with alcohol. Like that stuff? Daniel put us on that. The Japanese. The Japanese whiskey. Yeah, good. he loves it. Daniel. Isa it's gave me like there, three right? pounds of honey. Oh, that's the best. That and it's delicious. But hold, it's going to be three years by the time we finish it. That's per, bro, <laughs> that's fucking, he came in with a jar that's literally, it has oh, to be five pounds. Yeah, we can switch. That's good <laughs> stuff. That, that this is easy. definitely your size. <laughs> God damn. Good. You always finish mine anyway, so we can right, either switch. I mean, or you can pour it into us, yours. Whatever. Right. Manny, you might as well have You want one? No, no, no. I'm, 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 uh, Manny, you're not fighting. You want a whiskey? I'll tell you one. Ooh, you mind? Yeah. The last one to show up, Mar 10. <laughs> yeah. What you Come want? Come on, baby. Take it. What yeah. you want? You'll be all right. What you want? You got another glass? I don't know. Yeah. I'll, take, I'll take it. Oh, we even I'll got Bobby drinking. I'll take a little glass. There's one more glass over there. All right. <laughs> you come late, bro. This is the, Yo. <laughs> this is the consequences. <laughs> God damn! Your glass, and then, uh, oh, is that too much? No. Well, bro, it's a little bit, a little bit. I gotta be at the gym in the morning. Right. You could go a little more than that. You can go a little more. <laughs> there you go. That's good. That's good. That's it. All right. All right. All right. That's it. All right. Well, you're gonna have pour more. some of his right. or give me some of your mine. Cheers, guys. The Thank bar time was bitching. I was about to, uh, Cheers, fellas. The only reason we have the show is as an excuse to drink. Exactly. <laughs> For a reason. How is it? You guys like it? Really good. Tastes yeah. like whiskey. Or whatever. That's good stuff. That's, good. That's a very hard to find bottle, bro. I had to send a, somebody who had a connect who got it from my brother in law told me this story. I think it was bullshit, but <laughs> he, he asked for it because he wanted to gift it to the studio. And then the guy's like, oh, you can't find that shit. At least you can't find it easily. But I just happened to have one in the back office. That's where that came from. He might have poured like fucking Jameson in there <laughs> yeah. and just sold it to him. Whatever. It was a gift. I'm gonna pretend that it's something better than James. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, please. It tastes better. Than I James. think I think it's good stuff. I think it's delicious. Yeah. Um, Are you talking about the Rams, uh, three and no. Can start? you stop oh, posting about the Rams? Oh, that's oh, your God. team. That was. Uh, how do you like that's the your Rams? Team? Oh, that's his team. My team's the Colts. So we're not doing yeah. anything right now. My thing is, how do you like any team that's not? Uh, uh, what do you mean? I how? just pick the team. No, I. Team. You. So you're I go just, Philly. Every you're just. So you're just a. Front runner, I guess you can call yeah, it. Exactly. Runner. We're doing ads. Wait, so who are you? I didn't for? want to say it. But mm. Eagles. Oh, you're Eagles. Everything mm. I'm Eagles, bro. Mm. I don't nah. know anything about football, but I'm Eagles. Nah. Saying, you can't well, if you, that's the thing. I'm gonna if get you, you a Cooper Cup jersey, man. Who's Cooper Cup? I don't know who that is. Who's Cooper Cup? And he's got is a he Flyers. Rams? He got a Flyers shirt on, but. You're a walking contradiction. I like the Flyers. I my like teams the Flyers. are mixed up, man. My teams are all my teams are all jumbled up. And Flyers is who you pick? Diehard Rams fan. I mean, if I was to pick some, some, uh, I was about to say golf. <laughs> hockey team. I didn't. <laughs> they want me to watch no golf. Oh, we weren't talking about the Rams, though. What were we talking no, about? No, we can talk about the Rams. talking about fishing? I don't know. Do you fish? About the Rams. No, I want to learn. We haven't gone shooting. Oh, you guys are shooting. I'm yeah. trying to You're down to shoot? Hell yeah. You're down to shoot? Hell yeah. Let's go. Every Let's day. plan something. I really want to go. I was going to ask you about that, too. Well, so we can go to the regular range and just shoot. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't want that either. But I can take you guys if you're willing to take, like, a fucking hour drive. There's a place that um, it's clay shooting, mm. yeah. but the course is fucking beautiful. Over Georgia. a lake and shit. That's all shotguns, right? It's all shotguns. Where's that at? PA. Why are we doing it? Uh, can you pull it up? It's uh, <laughs> yeah. I, We've done this before. but Sunday? it's What? Huh? Sunday? I can't do it this weekend. This but guy. soon. Uh, uh, see, not fucking something valley. Is that yeah. yeah, bro. We'll talk about it in a minute. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm going to ruin the surprise. It's a, it's a preview now. So, why don't we. They don't know. <laughs> so, they don't know. While, while Gabby pulls this up, uh, should we. At Lehigh Valley Clays, I think that's what it's called. Would you. Should we do like a seasonal cage side clay or should not make it 4 1, just fucking go? And we should make it a thing. Let's see who do wants it the to first go. time and do it. And see how happens. See, see, yeah. see, <laughs> see, see if we all walk out. Because you got to do it once to make it like a tradition. This shit know? looks so You can't make it a tradition the first time. Well, I guess you can, but. <laughs> I like to think, make things formal, bro. Sorry. I would, I'm, I'm down for that shit. I think this would be fun. T- show them some of those pictures. Fucking yeah. beautiful. Yeah. I'm down. You can take a golf cart around if you want. You can walk. Right, you can rent guns there. You can bring your own shit. <laughs> no, it's it's a beautiful walk, bro. You want a golf cart now? Ooh, Ooh, you golf. said it. I'm gonna need to find a sponsor <laughs> to be able to pay for this trip. Sponsored by 
if we talk about McDonald's again, where the whole fucking Taco thing's done. Bell. Or no, it was Taco Bell, my bad. Anyway, yeah, it's a beautiful yeah. spot. You guys are down. We yeah. should go. Oh, yeah. That's how. Was that the whole, the whole course? No, she. It, yeah, but Gabby she didn't really she show you a good. She pulled up the map of it, like yeah. the. Uh, oh, ammo Just, shortage. You saw that? Can, uh, is there no picture? Your own rounds? Oh, they did tell me that last time. This is ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> There's no ammo anywhere, yeah, right? bro. I don't even have rounds. There's gun shows everywhere, man. There's rounds around. <laughs> they actually, I called to try to do like a group thing there. I think it was for f my birthday or some shit. I don't know. Um, and they were like, well, you need to provide your own ammo and you need to have a certain type of ammo. I'm like, Jesus Christ. It's not easy what, to find. This place? When I called, I don't know if it's changed. A lot, any range now. Even like 9mm ammo. You can't get it. Easily. Or cheap. Isn't it because so, they stopped yeah, like I, the... Because uh, everybody hoarded it when I thought they COVID. stopped like the shipping stuff too. Like the crates out in the ocean. Like they, there's a hole of that right now. There is. So maybe I don't know that's playing a factor. Huh? <laughs> I don't know if it was ammo. Nah, look it up. We're going to change that up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yo, that shit do sound like, like a movie. Yo, exactly. It is, it they're is holding them hostage. Life is like a crazy ass movie right now. That's, what, that's what's crazy about it. But it's real. That look sounds like a Tom Hanks movie. It's scary. Yeah. Man. What's going on in this world? It's scary, but let's not even yeah. get into that. I don't even you have been getting very philosophical, I've noticed, I on know. your Instagram. I know. You're, yeah. eating, you're eating baboon hearts. And, and hearts? some shit like that. Just like organ meats, just okay. like, just well, like beef or, And I'm not eating the organ. It's organ it's supplements. Disgusting. I'm excited. Right? Shit, if they'll sponsor me, heart and soil. I had a heart before it hooked me up. The texture. Is yeah, it's disgusting, but the, it's just like little capsules. It's, it's super good stuff. Wait, no, wait, one, uh, no one's gonna explain what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> so he's saying that. <laughs> he's saying, <laughs> well, the problem is that hearts? he's not on social media. He's he not. only goes on social media once a day and posts RAM pictures. Well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but if he was paying attention to his colleagues. Yeah. He would know that Bobby is an avid uh, well, meat or not well, uh, uh, nutrition meat, meat yeah. conscious human being. I just been getting back to my roots, man. Just, just the earth, <laughs> earth's roots. Just is this meat. the Nicaraguan side? Is this the Nicaraguan like, side? Like, yeah, like, yeah, it may be. You know, that's why I gotta get. Is the that what you want the DNA test? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, or the Brazilians. You know, I may yeah. have some Brazilian in there, Portuguese. This episode is oh. gonna be sponsored by Ancestry.com. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good sponsor to have too, you know. What are you eating, Sean? Wait, what do you say? What are you eating? I said, what are you? Oh, what are you? You have a mixed background. <laughs> we, we're not getting into me. I want to talk about these hearts that he eating. Oh. Uh, so I'm not eating. That. That's a good good thing to talk about, right? Because I can not. I can like teach some people. Some Please, here, right? I would love that. Because so Michelle doesn't know, but I'm getting my health together, so I need to hear this shit. They just are so full of like oh vitamins and nutrients. The hearts. Just organs, just like liver, heart. Stop laughing, man. <laughs> yo, yo can't take don't take serious, fucking bro. nutrition advice from bro, this guy. I'm not. I, 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 you don't even have abs. Like, come on. I'm not. What the fuck is wrong with not having abs? Right? That's what I'm saying. We're fighters. You gotta be looking good. Yeah, fair enough. All right, you guys are good. I mean, man. Gas get it together, Manny. But this. All right. Gas you you can fight. That, you can fight. That's all that matters is you can fight. Oh, you see. Cormier. <laughs> By the way. Just tell me you don't pull the pants up right before you fight. Oh, just I don't do that. Too, but, but, you know, it's nice to have the shorts. Not like that. He goes up. No, to he the goes. Head. He goes under <laughs> the titties, bro. He goes up to the titties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or you should start taking the organ meats. You know, I'm there we go. Supplements. Wait, so it's a capsule? Supplements. Yeah, oh, it's so a, it's supplement. a supplement company, and it's just like. Oh, I thought. It, wait, so it's. Like, but people, he eat organs. Saying people eat like, organs. He's saying it like you like took it straight from the animal. People do that. Well, when people hunt, pull it out the fucking. When people hunt, they eat heart. It's hard to get the meat like that. Like how they're saying it's it's not. You got to go hunt for the meat. You can't really buy heart. But shit, if I could buy it, I'll I'll eat it. You know. You can lose a pillow. Yeah, it's pills. Oh, it's wow, pills okay. That's not that bad. Oh, just yeah, it still it. kind of tastes bad. Like when you burp it back oh. up, when it like starts. See, to... you made him conscious about the abs, and now he's covering himself with a pillow. He's got abs. I don't. I, no, I got. got abs, no, I got abs. Yeah. I got. He abs. got abs. No, right now. I got like Man. four of them now. I got more than you got. <laughs> <laughs> don't come for me. <laughs> Shit, I do my motherfucking sit ups and Russian twists. Uh, Petroski, you said it's not very good at doing mitts. With so I should stay away from that part. But he Man, did get me into. He's great at doing mitts. <laughs> if you need to hit Patrick, yeah. but he Andre... did. But he did get me into doing eight minute abs, which is a 1994 well, he's video. Ripped. What? Yeah. He's ripped. So I can't eight even. Minute. I'm looking. That's what I was told. That was my point. He made me do it. I'm like, well, who the fuck am I to say no to this? Yeah. But he's I'm also... dad bod. He's got you know his eight pack. So yeah. I'm, I'm gonna follow whatever he says. He says I do it every day. <laughs> every day. What was that accent? That's how he talks. I don't know. He has. To, I don't know. He has a bit of a vocal fry. Who was he talking about? Andre. Who was that? <laughs> <laughs> he just made up so much. Yeah, well, yeah. I was 
trying to figure out who that would be. I'm like, <laughs> my <laughs> accent wasn't on point. He doesn't have an accent. Yeah. Nah, he looks like, like he would talk straight Russian. Though. No, he, he does. He, he, yeah. he, no, he, he, he have you got, seen his last name? It's something Petrusky. in there. He needs but, to have an yeah. accent. He do got a bit of something. No, I don't know. Not it's like, a, not, it's, not it's, like from it's like, like, like a from it's like, like a New York or some, no. Else. It's like a it's where like from. I don't know where he's from. He's from he's from PA. Yeah, he's from. Oh yeah, he's from like not some different part. He has a different sound. I'm just saying, and he told me how to do eight minute abs. I do it every day. God, it's got 40 something minutes. million views. That's too many minutes. <laughs> that's too many minutes. Wait, it was what on YouTube? It? It's on, so you haven't heard the story maybe, but I told it already before. Pull this up. Let's see this. He, no, so go this on YouTube. So, no, so Let's he, so, 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 no. Oh, Bobby, fuck, no. he comes to my house. She's on it. I respect it. Come on. Fuck young Jamie. Jamie. She's, yeah, young, young, Jamie. young Gabby. Young, young Gabby. So check this out. So he comes while she pulls it up. Do you have to stare at the fucking screen the whole time? She's going to pull really, it up. Jesus. I'm like concerned about these eight minutes. <laughs> Bro, just you wait until you see this. I want to set. Wait, don't don't play it. I, I want to set. I want to set. Is the, it the, the first one? one? Yes. No! I, yes. Yes. I want to. I want. Let me set. 1970. No, 94, bro. Let me, let me set. Let me years set. Ago. Let, let, let me set the stage. God. He comes to my house, right? I'm like, I'm just gonna do whatever this fucking guy says. It is what it is. He knows what he's doing. He's get on the bike five minutes while I set up. Cool. And then he goes and whispers to my Apple TV in the basement, and he says. Uh, big booty mix. I'm like, God, all right, I hate that thing. all right. I'm being serious. He, always, he puts it on all the time. Is yeah, it good, is it good? he puts it. So that's what we yeah. did for like while well, we did hit mitts and did weights. And then at the end, he goes and whispers eight minute abs. I'm like, all right, finally we're gonna get like a fucking hardcore, you know, yeah. legit modern video, and then play it. This is what comes up. You won't be able to hear it. Can we get this on? No, the don't fucking make the set look bad. Give me the of all the yeah, places you can put it, bro. Why do you have to go? Up this <laughs> Cause I forgot that. The Remember, I I right. kill that thing to eat yeah, the heart. I'm just you eat heart too? No, no, I haven't uh, eaten the heart. Can we get this on the screen? Though, but in so Puerto Rico, you know how much shit we've guys, eaten. Bailey, you won't be able to play it, right? Oh, uh, you she can't see it, but we can see it real uh, quick. That's not it. That's that would be better. That would. Yeah, it's right here. God, yeah. it's like a VHS. It is a VHS. It's honestly, it's something Andre would play. Too. Oh my god! Oh, the guy's hilarious. I already know everything. With the he headband on. No, he but he has no, but he has blue blue tight. Leo Towers or whatever the fuck they're called. Uh, spandex oh, pants. Yeah, no, no you know what? All of you try tomorrow morning. You let me know if it's bullshit. Just saying. Come on. Look at this. How can you even see what they're doing? This is like a fat cam video or something. You're making me feel bad. P90X. <laughs> P90X is hardcore. Bro. It is all right. I'm telling you, do it, and you let me know how you make out. I'm getting ass, bro. I'm getting ass. I can't watch this. You're getting ass. I'm doing, I'm, I'm doing a workout. All right. from my workout. I'm obvious. still doing the eight minute ass. We'll, we'll never know. We'll, we'll do eight minute abs. So, uh, I did a one private. You do it, bro. Do you see? And then you're gonna stay with no abs because you don't want to do it. <laughs> Just I guess I'll do it, bro. I guess Look I'll get this shit. I'm, I'm it's not. eight minutes. <laughs> and you gotta wear the pants too. You gotta wear. <laughs> I I mean it's, it has buy them for how many how many <laughs> Gabby how many views does that have? Thirty one million. Get okay. the fuck out. How many million of yeah, views do you guys have on like anything? Seventeen years ago. <laughs> that is fair. Yeah, yeah, it's time to get yeah, the yeah. yeah. <laughs> That shit's been collected. <laughs> Petrovsky texted me and said, We're gonna get it to fifty. Watch. I'm like, all right. Oh, all right. Uh, anyway, just give it a try. I think it's good. I'm gonna it works. Fun. Um we're gonna so do it. So we're we so we had one private so far and I already feel like I'm competitive with you one you gave me a six out of 25 no out of 10 review six out of 10. Mm -hmm. i'm training bro you didn't know this mm -hmm. i'm taking he's, one ambi fight before i yeah. retire my career my fighting career no you gotta go pro <laughs> straight pro? One pro yeah go down to um virginia <laughs> where they do strikes or no that was the pros anything anywhere no i'm good bro oh, sure. i'll go wherever they have the most rules that's fine. The most rude? The most rude. here. No hitting. Head gear, tank top. <laughs> Don't bring that back. I already got yelled at for comparing uh, boxing and uh, oh, MMA. Shit. Damn. I love boxing, though. Boxing's, awesome. boxing's fantastic. It's a little boring. But uh, did you guys see uh, Anthony Joshua yeah. lose all his belts? I didn't watch that. Much. Yeah, all of them? That didn't interest me that much. All of them. All Again. Of them. Russian guy, right? Yeah. How many belts? That legit lose? I think he has three. Did you see the Canelo thing? At once? Uh, yeah, when, uh, it's boxing, bro. They got to unify. Uh, Canelo and Plant. Wow. Nice. He's the goat. I don't care. Yeah, I love Canelo. He's the goat. He, yeah. Caleb Plant's going to win. If he fought, if he fought Plans, if he Mayweather, win. in his pro he would 100% be on. That's what we've always said about Mayweather with every yeah, fighter. And it never yeah. happens. And he's become that guy. 
I'll say he's going to probably lose, and Canelo never loses. Nah, yeah. I can't see him losing. But he cut him with a three piece well, real quick. I think it was his glasses that it cut was. him. He smacked him. He still had just a bad look. It was a bad look. That was awesome. So, back to your story. Real quick, I want you to get your chance to tell your final story. So, you grew up Camden, and then when did you get into fighting? Actual fighting. So, I, ch- I started wrestling in like middle school. Okay. Then started wrestling in high school, you know what I mean? So, obviously, like, the rest. Why is he staring at me like that? He's interested. I love He's interested story. in so, anyways. <laughs> He's only here for the story. Anyway, so, wrestling, obviously, is like a great base for it, you know what I mean? It got me into fighting, like, it's what I wanted to do. Yeah, he's on Alright, alright. All right. So just drink your whiskey and relax. I can so yeah, say like wrestling anything. wrestling like the competitive side, obviously, you know what I mean? And I was always getting in trouble, I was always fighting and I just I just fell in love with it. I would come home, I would have like knots on me, my dad would be like, Again, bro, like you Was you your dad a fighter? Like No, no, no. My dad would be like But was he a scrapper bro. growing up too? Like was he yeah, I mean, you got it from him? Yeah, I'm I'm guessing. I'm guessing he got into some stuff, but uh yeah, man. I think I had my first fight at like 18, 19. But I was at I was at the wrong gym for sure. When and did then, you make the switch? So, like four years ago. Okay. Yeah. And then when I started training here, it was more like wrestling, like high pace. And I was like, oh shit, this is like the real. Okay. This is like what MMA is. You know what I mean? So how much do you typically weigh? I walk around like two times. 210. Yeah. And you walk around about two, two something, oh, too. Let's be real. You, no, just told me you to gotta be 205. You just told well, me to shut up, and then you're gonna attack me out of nowhere. <laughs> like, I, on, I only bring that up because I asked earlier I if they sparred, and they said no because of the size difference. I, I feel like, do you two spar? 195. 195? Put a scale up right you ain't no 195 right now. I'll step on the scale tomorrow. I respect it. He's gonna cut weight tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Ninety five. Ninety five? Stay asleep. Okay. And two ten. So how does the sparring go? How do you guys work? What's the what's the good. dynamic there? It's good. Give me something. I feel, <laughs> I feel some tension right it's here. Sparring, I didn't even hear I didn't even hear the question to be honest. I think does he say, does he do when you guys spar do you also take you do wrestling as well? You incorporate it's, it's everything? Down. That's what I was wondering. Yeah, I'm putting him down the you mean, I don't know you don't show him how to you mean mm. he's a blue belt. He know. Okay. Oh, he know. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Should be getting free. <laughs> Yo, this guy. Oh, oh my God, kids. He know. So you try to keep him on the on the feet, just to avoid the takedowns. Just to avoid that. Yeah. Yeah. You know. He don't really. He don't really do that shit though. He be standing. He be standing up. Sometimes that shit come out of nowhere, but he be standing up for the most part. He said you guys go heavy sometimes. Is that true? One hundred percent. Like this. Everyone. Sessions. Everyone. Sparring. No, you don't have it. You take it easy on. I'd be chilling. Oh, you were just nah, no, I'm talking about. You talking about everyone in the room? No, no, I was talking about you two specifically. Oh, yeah, no, I take it. I take it easy. You, you take it easy on him. Nah, that true? Man, well, we need him. Don't really go hard. Okay. Nah, I'm just trying to feel it out. He man. do hit me with those calf kicks though. That <laughs> my, my leg there for two weeks. Now, oh, you time. did tell me about that. My he did call you out for. it. But he said you you yeah you just gave him credit that he showed it to you. That you don't know those things existed until he oh, kicked you. Oh, you bringing up old shit. Oh. <laughs> Paul Paul used to hit me with it all the time. Oh. And he showed me. It's a little different type Who's this? Felder. Oh, Felder. I used to spar him. Oh, sorry. You called him Dang, Paul. You hit me with that shit twice, though. That shit for like two, three weeks. Yeah. He used to hit me with it all the time. I spar, and I'd be like, yeah. what the fuck? Like, what am I doing wrong? Different. That's not getting these effects. And he'd like, show me a little thing. Definitely worked. Just where them. you hit in the in the calf area that yeah, makes a difference? Yeah, I feel like a lot of guys like cut. Cut to the kick where it's more like straight and quick. He was teaching, you know what I mean? I'm gonna try Bro, it. Don't give, to, don't give away that. Don't give away You see, I'm over here. I'm, yeah, look. Yeah. You write this shit down? <laughs> yeah. Not angled. Not angled. Go there we go. That's where, that's where I was fucking up. When's your next fight, bro? Oh, I know. I know behind the scenes, you've been offered several times, several matches that you yeah. that you that you didn't think those opponents were worthy of your skills is that true what i'm just making shit up i'm making Johnny shit up I think, all good, man i'm like what are, somebody, are they bringing these offers to you <laughs> you didn't know that i sort of mattered um uh i would like to fight on the 30th but you know how we'll is I would say the next Shit, I'm trying to get on that too, man. Yeah, yeah I, uh, I don't want to go anywhere. I want to find Wait, where's the 30th? 
I heard, um, I, heard, I heard the Hard Rock, but it could be Philly. Honestly, it's somewhere in PA. Yeah, what's that other casino that's out? Parks? Oh, that's Park, this weekend. Not huh? Parks. Um, oh, you're talking about Harris? the... It's one of those casinos that's Which in one did you say? It's not AC? No, it's in, it's in PA. That's why I want fire. I'm like, oh, I'm cool. Yeah, I don't want to fucking I go anywhere. I'm done. I was like, I'm done. Fight why don't you like to travel for fights? I feel like that's got to be part of the fun. Travel? No, no, not when you're cutting weed. Yeah. No. But then after the victory, don't you get to enjoy a little bit? No, I don't like... Not when you're in Mississippi, home. right? <laughs> Fuck <Yeah. that. laughs> Don't get me... No. I mean, um, some places, like, when you get there, sometimes when you get there, it's, like, fun. But, like, traveling fucking is annoying. Especially when you cut and wait. I think you guys should fight somewhere cool so I have a reason to travel. Just do it for me. It's, yeah, let's go up 95 to whatever casino <laughs> we <laughs> You're going to the fights. Are you guys going to the fights this weekend? Yeah. No. Yeah. I think Harvey. Harvey, yeah. yeah. I don't know. I was going to go with him. You were going fishing. <laughs> oh, you were? No, he was. He was. No. <laughs> he well, the plan that. was to go fish with Pat because he comes back from the Ukraine, like today, I think. He's been gone for like 12 Where? days, right? Yeah, he went to I'm the Ukraine. I'm jealous, actually. It looks like a lot of fun. Yeah. He was worried. Fun. He's like, yeah, he's been gone. I was wondering where he was. Did you see the picture that he posted? <laughs> he didn't text me and say nothing. Did you see the picture that he posted with like holding a gun yeah, and some other shit? I'm like, they got yeah. to him. They got to I him. I didn't see that. Very aggressive. He's gonna come back with an accent. One hundred percent. He's gonna some some say he's gonna come back and speak a little less yeah, than what he 100%. typically. <laughs> so no fight news. To, no breaking news. Sorry, did I cut you off? As no, always? no, no, no. It wasn't, it wasn't anything. <laughs> I'm sure it was something. I was getting back to the Rams point, but no fight news. <laughs> no fight news, you know. No. Are the Rams going to go all the way? Nothing, yeah. I mean, I hope, yes. I'm hoping to get on that card. But I don't think. So October 30th so is what we're pushing. Just, everybody yeah. just want out. All three of us. Uh, that, that would be fucking awesome. That would be dope. Oh, just load that shit up. That's all I'm saying. By the way, Please. we can just write the names in for that fight right. next door, and then it'll you be booked. Break in. Yes. Well, no, we can't break in. Yeah. The Load door's got to work. Shit up. No, we gonna fuck shit up. That'll be a good 100%. night. That'd be fun as shit. That'd be a good night. I tried. I tried to. I mean, we almost got to the point where this weekend we were gonna do like a live show from there to yeah. like half the fighters after the fact, but there's conflicts of at the COVID fights. rules. Huh? Oh, at the fights. At the fights. So like while the fighters are fighting, the fighters yeah. are coming through the show, and it's kind of like an ongoing kind of live stream thing. Oh, I thought that would be cool. Get in and get out every, like, but I think fighters like need to get out of the, yeah, the place right away. They kick you out. Right? Yeah. Like, yeah. So yeah. I think that's. But at some point, if we can pull that off, that'd be fun as shit. That'd be dope. So all three of you can fight together and then come through the show, crack the whiskey. Oh, yeah. I'll definitely drink come the whiskey on. After that you see where I'm going with this? All right. Uh, Gabby, why don't you throw up some current events since we've been blabbing for a while here? Right. See what we got. Let's see what I spoiled. Oh, oh Amy and Abs. Yeah. Look at this. Love it. You guys, what did you guys make of Doc's last fight? Man, I think. Played How good it right. did he look? I'm a fan. He's great, right? Yeah, yeah I'm he's a fan. awesome. I like and he can switch it up, you know what I mean? Like yeah. he, can, he knows his opponent. He, he didn't down? rush him. Right? Yeah, yeah. So, so I clipped the conversation we had about. The Beast, because I'm a I'm a big fan of uh, Derek Lewis, uh, and so is he. Like as far as like he's funny everyone, and he's a hard like hitter, him. you gotta like him. Yeah. Man, it scares me a little bit. He's he's got crazy power, man. Dawkins. <laughs> yeah, I mean any fight in UFC is dangerous, especially as that. For one. sure, especially so, heavyweight, right? I mean, he's getting what he you know that's probably what he wants. What now, he wants. so tell me this: so when he came out looking that good, because he looks fucking good compared to how he was looking when he was like yeah. a full on cop and he was heavy, yeah. like heavier. Um. I was a little worried because then his frame got smaller, and I'm like, "Is that gonna take away some of the power?" Or, or like, he still got it. He still has it, right? Yeah, definitely. He just knocked that guy out pretty bad. The speed's a huge advantage of that weight. Speed. Yeah. So that's a speed. benefit. Oh yeah, yeah he's got lightning fast boxing. He looks that's, that's what's that's probably like the best part. Yeah. Like of his game, his boxing and his hands. What do you think, man? They they're saying everything I was gonna say. <laughs> Dominic speed. Cruz versus Pedro Munoz. Huh? That just got That's gonna be good. That's a crazy. Fight. Yeah, I think Dominic. Uh, I wanted to Hooker see Hooker versus Makachev. Who? Yeah. Crazy fight. Hooker versus. Oh, I know. That just got announced. Is Hooker one of the best? You know, He's like savage, I was gonna say, down for fighting, yeah, kind yeah. of anyway, anyhow. Yeah, that's a tough. Fight Did you hear that him him and Izzy and the whole team is trying to move to the states? Yeah. Yeah, I think they are gonna. Yeah. That's because Australia. That's where they're from, right? Australia. New Zealand. New Zealand. It's like yeah. 
the restrictions are like terrible there, right? They have to, I think 12 weeks they have to quarantine. 12 weeks? After the fight. So like when he lost against Chandler, he had to look at his daughter through like a fence for yeah. like 12 fucking weeks. I saw pictures of that. That's, that's insane. Bro, that's not, that's not. With the like my thing is, why don't they, why don't they just rate, test the like, recovery yeah. rate? I know. Right. That's my thing. So if they're negative, what's what's the point? Plus, and if you got COVID before your antibodies are like, why do you need twelve weeks? Strong. Yeah. I don't know. It's, it's a weird time we're living in. And I'm sure, sure they're vaccinated anyway too. Yeah. yeah. The whole thing is just fucking. Nah, they're not vaccinated. It's... I don't think. Maybe some of them probably. Are. Nah, well, the UFC was offering. Well, I mean, they. I think they can choose not to, but they were yeah. offering, like, the vaccine to like yeah. promote an easier. But he's process. not gonna. He's not gonna force anyone. Though. He's no, 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 no. Well, that's what Chandler isn't. And that's why he was having issues apparently with the fight in New York. Yeah. Or something. Yeah, plus New York, New York everyone in the crowd has to be vaccinated. Like, right, but not the fighters. Speak. Yeah, the fighters, no. Yeah, yeah. At first they thought that fight wouldn't happen for that reason. Um, so yeah, Hooker, that's going to be, and it's not that far from now, right? This fight? It's like, I think, I think it's that's the December. Second. No, nah, that's 267. Maybe it is, I don't know. Two sixty seven? Isn't that the next yeah. the next paper? What? Yeah, but when is it though? I thought I it was it's October. October. Well, it's gotta be October oh, or November. Yeah, October. Oh wait, that's the night we're supposed well, I mean, yeah, the third hopefully we fight. Shit. That's night. a fucking quick turn. Yeah, it's a tough fight though. That's a, well, based Monica on DC, is, that's the toughest fight. But I feel like he doesn't it really, is the toughest fight. He doesn't really lose much. Yeah. If he loses, you know. Yeah, yeah. And if he wins, probably a title title fight. I am not impressed. You guys can explain to me why I should like him more, but uh, is it Makachev? Is that how you pronounce it? Yeah. Um, I'm not thrilled by his performances ever. Yeah, yeah he's that's connected to Khabib. Yeah, that's exactly. You know what I mean? Well, that's what But Khabib is. was exciting because he was so fucking dominant. Like, once yeah. he had somebody and their feet were through his legs and he was you clamping down, over, you're he's like, wrong, he's yeah. just mauling the shit out of him. Uh, but Makachev is like, just not, to player. me, it's not that yeah. impressive. I don't I mean, know. People are always going to think he's a little more than what he Wait, is. Wait, what's that? Fizz. O'Malley versus who? Oh, O'Malley's my guy. I love O'Malley. You like O'Malley? I'm a huge fan. Do you like his dribbling? That was okay. You don't know who O'Malley is? You don't know who O'Malley is? I know. You don't like I'm him? Done. I, no, I was, I was going to kick you. <laughs> <laughs> How? Because I like a UFC fighter? No, he fucked up what I was doing. <laughs> I'll play it back later and I'll see where you were going. Sorry, I missed it. Yeah, no, I like O'Malley, though. No, I like O'Malley. No, he uh, Well, he certainly put, what's his name on the map? The local, Tino. not the local guy, but he fought in the CFC. Oh, yeah. Matino. Yeah. Fucked him up. Chris but. Matino. Um, yeah, we'll see. Sean O'Malley's see, not even ranked, right? Him put him on no, the but he's oh, got him skills. Up. He's got great he's skills. Got skills. He's tall as fuck for that weight. This guy's 21 and 3. Where is and he's he? a flyweight, former flyweight. You gotta say where you're from? I just never heard of the guy. I've never heard of him. Yeah, or however you say Why are that? you showing us food now? It's up at the top. I think you can click on his name. How's your diet coming up? Oh, they got smoked brisket now. Dude, no, I'm not getting that from Chipotle. Do you calculate all your shit? Are you picky with your diet? Hell no. <laughs> calculate everything. Last time He's you a came... chef, ain't he? Aren't you a yeah, chef? he is. Hell yeah. But the last time he came on the show, he was like eating a bagel in the middle. He was hiding a bagel behind the couch thinking oh, I wouldn't notice. I think I saw that. I think I saw I'm like, why is he I fucking reaching for something? It. Was I? No, it was a soft pretzel. It's a soft there pretzel. There it is. I'm not saying <laughs> It was a like, soft pretzel and a coffee. He goes, I would never eat a bagel. <laughs> you don't like bagels? <laughs> Just start in the shit. middle of the thing, he starts to reach Yo. over the couch. I'm like, what the fuck is he looking for? I'm like it's thinking like, if I ever had a fucking bagel in my life. <laughs> <laughs> um... You're like looking at the camera. I love, pre- I love pretzels though. Soft pretzels? Uh, like Wawa Phillies? I got the best. Oh, they stepped f- their game up, man. I don't know. I'm not My kids love it. I'm not a fan of the Wawa? soft pretzels. Uh, I don't yeah, soft I don't pretzels. like them that much. Maybe with like some cheese. But the plain, they're Dip just a little too plain. plain. Annie Ann's, like some fatty shit. I like that. Yeah, oh, just a regular fine. pretzel. Remember the, the a Cinnabon from the mall back in the day? Remember. When they, they, still have they still have them? Oh, yeah. definitely. Really? Hell yeah. I feel like I don't see them anymore. You know why it's good that I don't know when they still have them. Bro, that smell, every time you walk by, how can you say no to that? We should have closed the window before the cops pulled up. (laughs) So be honest with me. Were you at home just chilling when I called you? (laughs) Yes, you were. 100%. Stop thinking I fucking answer. (laughs) Yo, I was looking at my clock the whole time, right? And I thought it just turned 6 (laughs) o'clock. Like, that's why when, when you were calling me, I'm like, bro, I got like, uh, that was like, the I got this funniest. Shit. Were y'all talking already? Were y'all? When I called you? Yeah. 
Well, they yeah. had gotten here. They were asking for you. And I said, well, I'm sure he's a little bit delayed, but he, he will be here. He's a man of his word. That's exactly what I said. Um, <laughs> but then I called you, and then you were like, but you said 7. And it was 7 one And I'm like, I know. <laughs> you got to fix your clocks, bro. My clocks. Anyway, I'm impressed oh, how quick you got here. Is, uh, yeah. I, I, uh... <laughs> you fly. <laughs> Whew. Um, damn. All right, you're yeah, I feel like a dick here. Nah, it's all good, though. No, it was a good time. It was a good time. We got to get some stuff out. Yeah. <laughs> some stuff out. How about you? And, uh... <laughs> a little therapy session. A little therapy. <laughs> now everyone's better. <laughs> We're all good. And now we uh, can pull up, uh... Are you not enjoying your whiskey? Hmm? You're not enjoying the whiskey? Yeah. Oh, no. I, I, I was going to, um... Uh, it's good. Uh, all right, Gabby. Let's, let's do this. What else we got? I can't see shit. So, you, you said some weird news stories. Oh, so, fuck. Missing drunk man. fan accidentally joins massive surgery. Oh, did you hear about this? Oh, my God. Did that's, you hear about this? No, nah, but that's how Manny would do. I heard, it was, uh, I heard about this. this funny enough. There. I know the weird news stuff. Yeah, so this guy, there's a big search for him. And they're out there walking with dogs, and they're calling his name. And he's part of the search. But he's fucked up and drunk. And he's also, and then at some point, he realizes that they're actually looking for him. That's crazy. He a dickhead. I don't know. Yeah, like, I, don't, I, don't. I think the dickheads are the people looking for him, not realizing that he's there. Probably talking to him while they're walking. <laughs> like, I'm sure he wasn't like, oh, I, I don't, you know what? Also, how long before people That's go out I'm searching thinking. for you? That's what I'm thinking. Like, where has he been? Number one. How did he, I don't know. And how drunk has he been for how long? Like, for how long before? Is there a picture of this guy? There's a how picture the of them wa- him walking with him. Man, what about that guy that you said? The pizza shop that his feet fell, oh his feet fell through the roof so or something. Get, there's a pizza shop near me called Two Brothers. Wait, wait, wait. Say this. Okay. What so happened? There's a pizza shop near me called Two <laughs> He texted us this morning. The funniest the shit. Is this, lo- like, is this real? Is this local? Yeah, this what is literally it? happened this week. Okay. So the fucking guy is coming through the, I guess, tried to rob the store through the top. Like, came through the top. Pizza shop. Fucking legs get, legs get stuck through <laughs> <laughs> so he that's he how far he gets well he died it's not fucked up oh he, he died he dies but his feet are fucking hanging from the like what if I'm just trying to get a piece of pizza this motherfucker's feet are just hanging right from the fucking Wait, pizza. he's worried about him getting a piece of pizza and seeing the guy's yeah, like, like yo, how about you the... see, yo you see the guy's like no way that he died why did he yeah, die he oh, why man, how he got <laughs> <laughs> it's his story, not mine. I'm How did he sure. die? I have no idea. Yo, know, you said that, so nobody heard that corny ass joke you said. Yeah. What did you say? I didn't hear it. You said I said it. What did I say? <laughs> Something about dough. <laughs> <laughs> did I, I definitely missed that. I was, oh, like, I was in my head, I'm like, yo, they don't think this is funny. Yo. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't. I didn't make. Oh, no, I didn't put it together. Funny, so what was, what, was what was the joke? I don't remember what I said. Now. I was <laughs> oh, okay. Right, thing right. Came into my head. Gabby, play it back real quick. Let's hear the joke. <laughs> my I soul. Went, when I said it, I was like, all right, that was, I can't believe. <laughs> when I said it, I was like, all right, that wasn't funny. And my <laughs> <laughs> the show up brings it up. That's that's hilarious. It wasn't funny. I just was mad. Nobody else heard that shit. Yo, y'all. At least we got a good laugh out of it. We did. It worked. It worked. It worked either way. Oh shit! Now I want to. You did that on purpose. I can't believe you did that on purpose. <laughs> I love it. I gotta pull it up. Andy didn't miss a beat in here. None of that shit. I didn't that at all. Well, he did miss a beat. He missed it. He missed it all. <laughs> all right, Gabby, hit hit us one more. What do we got? The fuck I is saw, this? I saw this I saw video. This, I saw this. Yeah. Wait, what is this? It could be yeah, SM yeah. show too. I don't know what you guys are talking about. This guy, he like, I guess there was an alligator in his yard or something in his like drive through or driveway, and he just like put it in the garage or just trash. He put it in a what is oh it? the like alligator a trash thing? can. Yeah. You know, honestly, that came up a lot of times, and I just scrolled right past it because yeah. I didn't get the whole Dude, fucking what point. What the hell is the toenail thing? Let me let me see. Yeah, what is it? I got. Bad. I don't want to talk about that. That's a gross fungus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw this. Uh, I'll just leave him there. Honestly, I ain't. What? Does he catch him? Yeah, he gets him in there. You're going to tell me you would do that? No. I'm le- you I'm jump on that too. motherfucker. Yeah, I'm leaving. You jump on that thing. Come on. Show him, show him your blue belt the skills. The Absolutely crazy. not. He's going to win. <laughs> and he's small, too. But he'll yeah, that still, is a small one. He's still messing with him. Yeah, look. <laughs> bro, if that thing gets onto you and like, does a gator roll, you're yeah, done. I, I saw a video of that. To, like, also, what's he going to do with it in the trash can afterwards? He dumps it into like a river or something. It was honestly a pretty good... Oh, good, good for him. Yeah, it was clean. 
He could have died. Oh, they didn't show it at the end. <laughs> Meanwhile, the guy going to rob pizza. What's up with that bear he's standing nice. up over there? <laughs> Damn, he's tall. Yeah. Yo, I cannot I don't believe that shit. What? I was, I was really looking at the clock. I kept looking at the clock like, I got this, bro. Like, I know, and especially because it's later see. than normal. Usually it's 6.15. I blame you guys. We it's 6.15. <laughs> Maybe he would have made it on time. <laughs> Fair point. He's getting you back for you making fun of his joke. Yo, he's walking the trash can. <laughs> <laughs> why would he say that, though? <laughs> Wait, why would he say what? That he's walking the trash can? No. Oh. Maybe, oh. I guess I, maybe it was the doze thing again. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> he's still on it. Are we, ju- are we just going to watch uh, animal videos in trash cans? <laughs> <laughs> this, this could be a new segment, Gabby. Oh, it history. goes back into the trash Oh, he fell in the trap. This happens to humans, though. Nah, he's eating. He's grubbing. He's grubbing. Right. Did we got fights this weekend? Yeah, there is, right? Oh, wait. Actually. Marcus versus Holland. Oh, Marcus that's Holland. a good fight. Great fight. Plus the CFFC fight. We got my boy Miguel fighting. Yes, sir. Minute. Who else fights? Riley fights. Riley. Riley. Miguel fights. Does he train with you guys? Yeah. yeah. How come I've well, never seen him anywhere gym until gym this time? Um, so, but he was with us, and then he, he opened his own gym. Okay, good. Because I didn't know that. And I'm yeah. like, who? I didn't know who he was. Yeah. And he's fighting Fumi. Yeah. You guys don't get along with Fumi? I mean, I don't know the guy. Nothing against him. Okay. I don't know. Yeah. You like Fumi? Uncut. You know? You know? No. How's he he trains with Aljamain. Yeah. I mean, I know of him. Yeah. I know of him. He's a nice dude. He was on the show. I didn't even know that. He was on the show. I didn't get Miguel on the show because I didn't know who the fuck Miguel was. Until now yeah. that he's fighting everybody, it's like, oh, our boy. He's been away for a little bit. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. But now I know. The gym is like in Michigan or something. Yeah, it's in like uh, Grand Rapids or Grand something. Daniel Gracie Grand Rapids? Yeah, yeah. that's his That's his gym. Oh. Well, he's like the co-owner. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Oh. I did not know. Uh, this Week in Fights, uh, Michael Venom Page mm. against, yeah, what's his name again? Diego Lima. Diego Lima. Douglas Lima, one of the or, two. One of the Lima's. Douglas, I think it's Douglas. Who knocked him out last time. Yep. Yeah, Douglas. Uh, you fought Michael Venom Page. Did you? You did. Damn, I didn't even know that. Uh, you said you were not very impressed by him. Those are your words, not mine. I mean, no, not really. Who wins his fight? This fight? Hopefully not him. <laughs> I don't like him that I'm much either. Like they pick his fights a little bit. He's kind of he's, weird. Too. He's not. He's he's weird looking and weird acting, right? Yeah, he's weird looking, definitely. That little. I don't know. Well, he was used to do the the. <laughs> and he does the Pokemon. He would do the Pokemon yeah, chip for a while. Whack. I remember yeah. I saw that the first time. I was like, Yeah, but you know what wasn't whack? When they edited, it, they came down with a cape. He came out. He comes out with like the Naruto type shit. It's weird. Only Izzy can pull that shit off. Yeah. The the Brian Ortega thing was kind of cool. The mask. My kid loved it actually. Yeah, that was. That was He's cool. like, this is the shit. He didn't say that, but that's what he meant. <laughs> yeah, it, was cool. <laughs> it was cool. It was cool. Oh, these are the fights. Or take is there any way you can blow this up Nico or us blind people? Oh, that's a good fight. Wait, doesn't doesn't Randy fight this weekend? Randy you should Brown? be able to double yeah. click the mouse. Or the dude, Randy something. Brown fights this weekend too. He he's been oh touch and go. Yeah, he's been he's, he's been, been, been on the, show. the past couple weeks. I mean, not with me, but I don't know the guy. He made me feel stupid. <laughs> um, <laughs> he posted some shit about a tattoo on his face, and I was like, seriously, bro? And he's like, Yolo, and then obviously it wasn't true, and I'm like, oh, he's I feel like you played that? me. I don't think no, he did. I think he just played me. But it was Who like, all right, bro. My bad. It's some good fights. Don't though. care about the main event. What's the main event? Johnny you don't Walker. care about that? Nah. Who is it? I don't like Johnny Walker. Uh, like oh, Johnny Walker. Walker. Yeah, I'm not a big fan either. That co-main oh, event's cool dope, name. though. <laughs> so, Dawkins versus Holland. Who do you guys got? I don't know. got to go with Dawkins. Just because of Philly, though? Or do nah, you he's think... got good grappling. I think, yeah. I think he's he got good submissions. Destroys him grappling-wise. Is that what you think his game plan is going to be? Because striking wise, do you think Holland has an upper hand? I mean, it's not even that Dawkins' striking is not good. It's just that you could, why would you take advantage of it? You know what I mean? Plus, I thought, that's his special. I think that's his special. Thing. Yeah. His grappling. Yeah. I thought not the last Dawkins fight, obviously, but the one before that, he looked fucking crisp, crispy, which is his word. Uh, very crispy. Uh, no, he looked. I thought he looked phenomenal with the striking. The last, he he lost, right? the last one he oh. lost, which was the guy who trains with Brunson, with the blonde hair. Did he fight the big giant black guy? <laughs> <laughs> I forget his name. He's like uh, Halls, Phil Halls. That's who he lost he's against. Husky, that's why. Yeah, 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 yeah he yeah. lost. Yeah. Uh, it's a huge Brennan win. Allen, yeah. Brendan Allen's tough too. It's a huge win for Dawkins if he gets if he pulls oh, that yeah. off. Huge. 
like him and his brother are going to really quickly get yeah, to the top of the UFC, which is awesome for them. Yeah. Do you guys ever? They don't ever. You guys don't ever cross train, right? No, nah, not with them. No, no, I never met them. Actually, I think I met Chris one time. I don't remember. I think it's, I met him with Andre and all them guys. Yeah. Uh, well, anybody else worthy on here? Nico Price versus Alex Oliveira is a good fight. I like Nico Price. Aspen Lag, I don't really like her, but. <laughs> I mean, she's really gotta get my eyes though. I think uh, the other girl wins. Let me see. Who's the, who's on the prelims? Uh, do you? Oh, the Lecky Gordon. Gordon. That's a good fight. Yeah. That's a local fight. Oh, it's your girl. Oh, Shevchenko. Yeah. Uh, wait, oh, okay. Antonina O'Neal was my girl. Yeah. Casey O'Neal. Beautiful. Let me see Casey O'Neal. Dang, this undercard is actually good. God damn it, Gabby! Seven and zero. I can't see shit. Right, you don't remember? She was like. No, crying right. when she got the bonus. Oh. That, was, that was her? Yeah. No, no that that's was, not who it was. No, no, no but I know who you're... That I was know who this Cheyenne Bice. Yes. Oh, no, it Who's, wasn't her. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but this girl is still but hot. This girl, this she girl just posts hot. stuff on Instagram. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> but she's undefeated. <laughs> like, oh, yeah. He said, yeah, she, I was like, Same he said, shit. yeah, she's hot. Same but shit. But she just cross eyed <laughs> Same shit. Same uh, shit. Yo. Nah, bro. They look way You can't different. say they all look the bro. same. Bro. They just have black hair. You gotta tell me she's, she's not really. She's a pretty girl. Dang. She, yeah, her I Instagram. Don't know this is, this is I don't who know started posting. <laughs> <laughs> this is Cheyenne. This is who you were talking about. She started crying after the win. Yeah, she's cute too. Yeah, I like her. I follow her on Instagram. <laughs> but Antonina is still, <laughs> An- Antonina is still numero uno? Nah, she's not, not numero uno, but I'm a fan. I like her. Okay. I don't know who... My who's who's your number one? Who's your number one? Give me your number one female fighter, number one male fighter. Like favorite fighter? Paige Manzer. Or like best looking. Like you can pick whatever you want. My favorite fighter is either Rose or Shevchenko. Oh, Rose. Them two are my, like, they may be my, one of my like top five like out of girls and boys. Okay. Uh, but best looking, I don't, I don't know. No picks? <laughs> You're laughing over here. No, no picks on your foot? Yeah, you don't got it. Yeah, come on, bro. Um... You're like, this Two is a stupid question. Uh... <laughs> the Rams. <laughs> the Rams. Man, that's a good fight, though. Uh, um, past or present? Hey, bro. Who, no. who else is on this? Muhammad Ali. A little bit? <laughs> 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 like, what? I thought, what is he? He is on there. Uh, yeah, I don't know any of them guys. All right, is this fight going to be like a midday fight or some shit, or is this going to no, be... No, this is at nighttime, because that's, 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 that's why the time. CFFC fights are at 1.30. Oh, shit. No, this yeah. one's a... This Seven, it's pretty early. Yeah, this, that's why this is a nighttime, or that's why CFFC is early. Uh, so that yeah, way that they early. can broadcast both. Yeah, Ooh. I don't... The last fight night was lasted longer than a pay-per-view. I don't understand why. Yeah. I, hate yeah, I always told. fall asleep, man. I still have, like, I regret going to sleep at 1.30 after these goddamn fights sometimes. Like, <laughs> See, I don't. I'll just... I'll slowly get into bed and start falling asleep. Like the fights will be on. I'll turn the light off. I'm like, all right, I'm not gonna lay down. I'm just gonna turn the no, light no, off. I'm not gonna cover get... myself. Yeah. Just gonna... <laughs> then next thing I know, I wake up 3 a.m. and the fights are over. Yeah. I stay up. I enjoy. Yeah, it. I miss them. Not all of them. What? Yeah, I know you. I, I thought I had my my favorite fighters, but like. Still thinking. Still thinking. How about you, Danny? Danny, you know what I'm saying? It's it's all, all all of lifetime. My favorite fighters. It's a lot of ever, like. But you haven't picked either. Who's your I favorite? I thought you were talking about girl looks. Like, girl, favorite girl look fighters. <laughs> yeah, By the way, you yelled uh, Paige Van Zandt in like two seconds. Oh, yeah. It's yeah, easily. I'm you like, think I'm, that's the only professional, that. that's the only UFC fighter I saw when I went to Vegas for another reason. Like, I, I was, I think it was close to a fight or something. I'm like, oh, like, yeah. that's cool. You know, I wonder who's going to be around the Paige Van Zandt. It's the only one. I'm I don't airport. think I've ever saw a fighter She's big. around there. She's big? She was big. For I really? thought she was like a short kind of I stocky. I thought she was like a short Tall. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, she's the bare knuckles a little crazy. But. It's not going well for her. Nah. I think fighting just fighting doesn't go well for her. Her yeah. her, her husband's a savage. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. He's undefeated in Bellator, yeah, right? Yeah. The, the tat- neck tattoo is terrible. Austin, yeah. something. He's got. He's all tattooed. Yeah, Te- have a terrible neck tattoo. Like Are big, they terrible? Well, it's like a fucking very watercolory mm-hmm. heart or some <laughs> shit in his neck. It's, it's like a comic. She seems like Austin knuckle? something. She's done two bare knuckle Austin, fights in Boston. Uh, Austin is messed her up. Just probably got paid bank. Oh, probably got paid crazy. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. I told you to take <laughs> your bare knuckle more seriously. Oh, my fucking hands would fall apart. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't do bare knuckle. Fuck that. 
Yeah, it's a hands more than anything. I feel like a. Yeah, our guy, our heavy. guy won. He's what two and zero in Daredevil. Or What's his name? Who? Jason Knight. Oh, I see. Oh no, now he's in PFL. Nah, he yeah. just fought for. Uh, fought, I thought he fought, fought for the, the game, game bread, bread, but then yeah. he got into the PFL ah. because of that. But then they nice. canceled because of COVID or some shit. But yeah, oh, he's. Sucks. He fought someone real good at PFL recently. The game bread is crazy. I think it was just, a short notice, like. Uh, yeah. The game bread thing. You know what sucks about the game bread thing? MMA. Yeah, but cool. you know what sucks about it? It is such a cheap looking venue every time when is they it? do it. Oh my lord. It looks like there's a quinceanera in the back room. <laughs> and then. Where do they do it? Where do they do it? It's in Florida. Oh. Yeah. It's, it's Mazarol's like like show. CFFC blows it out of the fucking oh, water. That easily. But it's game bread. Like you put your name too. on that shit though. Yeah. But I feel like most of the bare knuckle shows are like more. Uh, like. <laughs> I don't know. Lower class? Yeah, lower class. That's exactly right. Like Getting guys just, off the street. Just going yeah, just like, there. just bar fighters. I like how he, like, like eases his way into it. <laughs> They're pieces of <laughs> shit. Nah, nah. <laughs> he just nah. basically said that. I wouldn't say that. He's like, oh, there's a... Just probably guys that need to get paid, you know? No, the, nobody's yeah. Nobody's starting and yeah. their life training and wanting to yeah, be exactly. a bare knuckle fighter. Exactly. That's, That's a last exactly resort. Where I'm, uh, that was your... That was your dream? <laughs> this is this is How many more fights before the UFC? Like, what's what's the plan? Give me yeah, let's set. Let's set too, a timeline. Bro. I'm curious too. How many more knockouts? You said four knockouts before. Yeah, what are you you got four? one, and then you're sitting it out on the sidelines. What are we doing? One. I got two. Bro. Yeah, and then you got the no. When you said you wanted four, you only got one after that. Oh, you do have two in a row. Uh, he even I don't know. Maybe two, two more. Two. One more. Strangle. Yeah. Uh, maybe. Can we fast track you a little bit? One more. You're not getting any younger, bro. I know this. <laughs> Your lips to Robert's ears. Tell him to call me. Hit me up, baby. Try rubble. I I can't I can't divulge, but I did hear some rumblings. <laughs> I think they were they were high on you, man. After that knockout, there was potential there to fast track you into somewhere. Nobody know my phone number. Bare knuckle. <laughs> Bare knuckle. <laughs> I think I might have to. I say you fucking take the paycheck, bro. Hands would disintegrate. I fucking never will. I can't. I wish I had stronger hands to do that shit. Why are your hands so weak, bro? I don't fucking years of damage or just. I didn't drink my milks. (laughs) That's because you're drinking soy milk or oat milk. Uh, Always had us straight. I I don't drink uh, fucking soy milk. Told you. I've been saying this. No soy milk. Bullshit. I don't drink that shit. What about almond milk? I don't drink nah, that I think tastes that like shit. Even drink I think, milk. So. What are you I think it tastes about? like shit. Oh I just don't think that's good for you either. Yeah. Like, the chocolate, oh, the milk. chocolate almond milk. But of course that's delicious. Exactly. But that has yeah. like 40 grams of sugar per yeah. like tablespoon. Yeah. Bro. The vanilla one taking for It tastes good, but it's not good for you. <laughs> my kid, my kid drinks that shit twice a day. Oh, oh shit. Shit. almond milk. The chocolate almond milk. That's his like just chocolate milk. A glass of it. A glass of it. It's got a lot of protein. A shitload of sugar. I, I like milk, bro. I'm a big Drinking milk fan. I still drink. He has a milkman. He gets his shit delivered in glass jars. No, no, we pick it up in glass jars. Uh, but close, close. It's I'm just close. one big glass jar, too. I'm being serious. Bro, At Amish market. Where do you get your milk? Shop, right? I don't drink milk. Yeah, what? Like, yeah. I don't drink milk. That was so derogatory. He was like, where do you get your milk? <laughs> Fucking shop, right? It's like, yeah, bro. You loser. Because <laughs> shop, right, is just like, I don't know. Yeah, we really wait, is, to cut it, me wait is Shoprite the bare knuckle? That's what it sounds like. like right. a, of like a Whole Foods <laughs> to UFC. I prefer like a sprout. <laughs> a sprout. <laughs> sprout. <laughs> or like the Amish market is pretty. Yo, did you hear his pinky go up when he said that shit? <laughs> I heard the thing. I heard it. I heard it. I heard it. Oh, I don't drink fucking milk. <laughs> what about no wonder your hands break? Where do you get your eggs literally? literally? From the fucking Shoprite. Shoprite. Shoprite right? <laughs> Everything's at Shoprite. What happened? I thought my phone was right. Um, shop right, right? I don't even or fucking active. have eggs. I don't. You don't eat, what do you eat? <laughs> fucking other shit. Chicken. I get my chickens from the chicken store. <laughs> Fuck the chicken store. Where gets the chicken from? So you no milk, shop no right. eggs. <laughs> yeah, like what does this guy eat? Oh, you fucking business. <laughs> my diet. My diet is all. Just here, I thought me. I knew what I was doing. <laughs> he just want to hear me say shop right so he can attack me. Nah. <laughs> I respect that. Yeah, it's shop right. Okay. Have you seen his 
food prep skills. Oh, bro, I fucking hell it's a yeah. beautiful thing. Beautiful. For coming from Shoprite, you make it look good. <laughs> I think you can you can shop at Shoprite. It's just the quality. Oh, My wife's family shop. all have ties he's to Shoprite. He's not. He giving me just he FYI. No, I wouldn't say it's bad. I wouldn't say Shoprite's bad, but I mean, you know. if you like to eat. Garbage. Floor meat no. that was on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> they packaged it. I mean. So is your meat only from butcher shops? I get my meat from uh, Butcher Box. You ever heard of Butcher Box? Yeah. Yeah, that's where I get my meat from. Bro, there's a difference. <laughs> like, there's a difference from getting it from ShopRite or getting it from like, like a Butcher Box. Steak. Nah, bro. I pay one sixty. I heard about the commercial. I get. I, I pay one sixty and I get like no. twenty steaks. You pay one sixty oh, a month? Awesome. Yeah. No. Uh, every box. Yeah. So it's like I'm. Yeah, a month. Pretty much. One hundred sixty dollars in yeah. meat. Yeah, that's not. If you think about it, it's not bad, not bad. in the long run. Not How many pounds long. of meat? I don't know what the exact number is. It's probably like. Got to be like ten pounds of meat. Probably more, I'd say. I probably bad. get like ten, maybe like fifteen steaks, twenty steaks, and they're hmm. all really good, hmm. grass fed, grass finished. Hmm. Shoprite don't do that. For me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you want to know why shop rate's bad? I'm not saying... I'm not talking... Oh, no. Yeah. You guys are saying it shop rate, so I'm going to tell don't, you why it's... I don't even shop at shop rate. All right, so then fuck shop rate, man. <laughs> nah, I respect you. But I'm, I'm listening to Butcher Bucks. No, heard, my wife does not work there. Heard, my wife's family nice. work there. It's doesn't matter. We make fun I'm of just shop saying, rate. Sprouts is the way to go. I like Wegmans and, tra- and Trader Joe's and... Trader Joe's is Whole good. Foods. Whole Foods, good. All good. Quality. Never they screw up. you. No, it's just, bro, if you go to ShopRite or Acme, right, they're not paying. You're like, even the meat, you know, it's not. They're paying probably huh? bottom dollar to get it. But shop where? Yeah. At Sprouts? Butcher. I've never been to Sprouts. No, I don't do Butcher Bucks. I'm waiting for them to sponsor the show so I can get it. I would love them to sponsor oh, me. That would be crazy. awesome. That would be crazy. They're yeah. not I mean, maybe in like a couple what years. What's the commercial sale? What's Cut yourself short. I like it. So how come how come Fuel Will Hunt gets free advertisement on the show and they don't ever reach out or send uh, anything? Uh, I, was, I was listening to the podcast about them that that hey, Curtis put. I start on the way here. I yeah. listened to it today. It was, it's it was good. good it's good. Yeah, yeah. They don't want to be on the show. I mean, they wanted to be on the show, but remotely. Yeah, I think they just move more in silence. You know, they're just about hard work. And That's what I do, bro. I move in silence. Same. <laughs> That's what we do. <laughs> um. So I see you've taken your Instagram game more serious. So I'm proud of you for that. But it's all about the Rams. You got to switch that up. You do good with that. Gabby, <laughs> should I skip? You don't have anything, do you? Barely any? I hate any? posting, man. Yeah, but I hate posting, too, but you got to. You got to do what you got to do. I am posting shit. I hate posting, too, bro. Like, I would delete it. Hoop I cut NFC uh, player of the month. Oh, my God. Am I getting the jersey? You give me the jersey, I'll rock it. You're an know. Eagles fan, you said? Yo. I mean, we watch. We Eagles watch. Jersey. We put well, on the Eagles every time they play because yeah, we're yeah, we're – Local people who support yeah. our local teams. And then there's these you know, you yeah, know. I mean, where are you from? You from Jersey, bro? Like, what other? What are you guys? The Jets. The Jets. Fuck like, out of here. Nobody I'm supports the Jets. The, the no, thing. bro. Like, take that shit back to oh. Jersey. Like, you trying to be an Eagles fan? They won the Super Bowl. Bro, that's shit, how like, all Jersey. Because they won the Super Bowl. <laughs> One two. Oh, we've been to. Oh my. Lord. I bet you was a Jets fan before that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, football predictions for the so we can wrap this guy up. Uh, who's who's taking it this year? Eagles Super Bowl. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I don't even know who's good. I'm gonna say Eagles. The Los Angeles Rams versus the uh, who the fuck ever. Well, Wait, so Tampa it's Bay's NFC is the Rams. No, I don't know. You think Tampa Bay's done? Something going on with them, man. Something weird. Something off. Brady like last done, season, bro. that shit. He don't. He looked good. It wasn't him. It was something's off. They they ain't look like last season Buccaneers, but we'll see. Who won the Super Bowl last year? Bucks. You know oh, they you know Tom yeah. gonna yell at somebody. He gonna get this shit fixed. <laughs> That's what I was talking. He, we were talking he, Niners, Chiefs, Bucks. Where, where Niners. Think? Not the Niners. I'm taking the, the Chiefs. Rams got, like the Rams gonna come out the West. Okay. I don't know. Well, the Chiefs the play the Eagles this weekend. this weekend. I hope they smash them. I hate them. 143. Why do you hate I just hate the Eagles. Their fans really make me mad. Oh, not the, they don't make me mad anymore. I used. To. You know why though? You know why? I feel like no. I feel like I feel no. like the Eagles fans would shop at Shoprite. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. They have the, they have that look. Shoprite. Ooh, Acme. That's terrible. Okay. You know, I'll tell you one story about Acme real quick. I'm sorry. I went to an Acme. I won't say which one nearby. Very nearby. And. I passed by a person that smelled very badly. That was step one. Then in the cheese Typical. dairy aisle where they have like, I found a cigarette butt. Typical acne. In the cheese. 
Hey, like you know how like, ever been like in the cold area? <laughs> Tip- fucking cigarette. That's all I know. It's a typical Acme. <laughs> That's why I don't go there. Okay, Brought to you by Acme. He's where not... uh, cigarette butts and there we go. He's never oh. been to Acme. I've been there like, a couple times. He just goes there a typical. Times. He drives by. He's like yeah. fucking typical Acme. <laughs> Fuck that place. <laughs> Throw something out the store every time. Losers. As you, as you drive by. Yeah. Wow. All we right. got some real. Well, you know, uh, Bobby's the uh, touch oh, point shit. of uh, negativity. Uh-huh. Shop right in Acme. Uh, anything else so we can wrap this guy up? Well, I would just like to say, um, as a Philly podcast, shout mm-hmm. out to the Philly shout team. Shout out to yes, sir. Philly yes. fighting. Shout out to Philly yes. fighting. Oh, yeah. Now I love Philly teams. teams. We <laughs> all support the Philly teams. And I by do, we, too. I mean us yeah. and Gabby. And, and, and Gritty. from fucking Jersey. Oh, Jets my God. <laughs> I'm from Jersey, too, but I like, I like the Colts. Well, you know, oh, he said, he said but he said, You're from Philly. Why would you, you like the he rain? said, why would you pick? Your team, you know, all that you know, hometown shit. That's his team. Thank you, man. <laughs> When's the next time you guys are sparring? Tomorrow. Just Saturday. call him a Jets fan in the middle of it and <laughs> see how hard he goes. No, no, we're not going to go hard. Tomorrow. We're sparring <laughs> after this. There's <laughs> no way in hell. He said you're not going hard. Those are uh, fighting words. Uh, guys, thank you for coming on the show. I appreciate it. Thank, thank you, you for you. making time out of your busy schedule tonight. I know you had lots going on between 6 and 7. Thanks for coming. Appreciate it. You're watching King of Queens while we were here stressing. We thought we had no show. Yeah. I actually almost called it off. Nah, we were having a good conversation. No, I heard it because I walked past the door. Did you hesitate? Like, I should. She's like, he's not going to 